welcome or welcome back. Thank you for joining me today. It's another Mask Monday. Happy Mask Monday. I've got Sawyer here with me. Um, I hope everybody's having a nice weekend. Um, I'm having a nice weekend. I have luxuriated and um, taken this Sunday while I'm doing my Mask Monday to, um, I've painted my nails, I've had an everything shower, lotioned up, um, dyed my hair. Um, I will say that next time I do my nails, I'm probably gonna do stickers because these gels, I mean, it was a lot of work and they're still not perfect and they were pain in the boot behind. So not so user friendly. And I cut my nails too, I cut them and I trimmed them down quite a bit and um, it was time. So I hope everybody's doing well and enjoying their weekend. I've heard about the weather. Um, on my nephew's birthday party, it was tornadoes coming and storming and everything else. I know tornadoes are happening in Texas today and I just hope everybody's okay and, <clears throat> and doing well. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and use the mask, the second of the mask that I used last time. And I'm gonna open up a little Timu haul and a little, a little, a little tiny Dollar Tree. Um, I've gotten mostly craft items, I think. And I should have, I should have already had this mask out while I was talking to you, let's see. Um, so I did, I put out a video, uh, a little bit of a video of the birthday party. My nephew is two days, his birthday is two days before mine. Um, and it was fun. We had a good time. Um, so my nephew was there and I hadn't seen him in a long time. And then of course my two great nephews, one of them was turning eight. Um, oh, I have to use the, I have to use you guys as to get it on good. Um, something funny about it was I, they did this little dance and I tried to do it like a dance montage and do like. I sped it up and I did that and put it normal and I tried to slow it down and I would have done that but when I played it back it sounded so creepy in slow motion it was like wah, wah. I mean it's real hard to explain but it was really freaking creepy I even was like am I being am I being overly you know what's it uh paranoid or something and I asked my husband, he's like, no, this is creepy. <laughs> it is creepy. He's like, that's the same song. That's the same song it was playing and all. I'm like, yeah, I mean, it was really creepy. I could just use that music of that little cactus thing um, in slow motion and make a scary movie out of it. All right, let's see. This is pretty good up here. It's pretty good there. Good there. So I need it most is still got some breakouts. I think I'm sick, y'all. Oops, my headband thing came off. I think I think I've got something. But our car quit working. I can't remember what's wrong with it, but it's got to be taken to the shop. And, you know, um, now Sawyer's having a spell. Okay, sorry about that, y'all. I had to pause it. Um, and I just went ahead and took my headband thing off because it fell off. There. And I'm sorry that I do often look in the in this thing 
it's just all right all right it's just the easiest way to do it um is that way um so so i did i did my nails i did my little cuticle oil on on them um you know had my everything shower um lotion i got cotton candy lotion on um dyed my hair i think i already said all that um turned another year older had some nice cake um i did get some cake um, I'm going to put some of this lippy on. It's got that juice from that mask all over everything. Anyway, I hope everybody's doing good and um, hanging in there. Uh, seems like a lot of us are feeling some kind of way and I am and I can't explain it uh, but I'm just gonna try to keep it moving and uh, yeah enjoy enjoy opening this package from Timu with you guys monster has gotten into it I'm still gonna okay Okay, here's the thing, wrapty, wrapty, wrapty. It's difficult to, I got my cloud. Let's try the cloud. Okay, that might have been the right answer. Yep. Again, I hope everybody, oh, this is way smaller than I thought it would be. Again, I do hope everybody is having a, is, is okay and hanging in there. I'm happy that you decided to hang out with me today. And I hope you're um, finding time to enjoy and take care of yourself. This is way smaller than I thought it would be, but I like it. I believe it is Dalmatian Dalmatian Jasper. It is real. Try to so you so it doesn't fall. Anyway, I do like it. I just definitely thought it would be bigger. <laughs> But that's okay. I do like it. I do like that. Put it over here. Okay. Um, this is, oh, what's it called? Um, maybe it says on here. I'm just drawing a blank. Peel and stick, peel and stick, and um, it is hummingbirds and other kinds of birds on here. It is not looking quite it's a, like a navy color there. Anyway, um, this is for a project that I, the project that I'm currently working on and then my glasses go fogging up. <sighs> Maybe because I forgot to turn the fan on. But it's it's like if I turn the fan on in here, then you guys have a harder time hearing me, I think. So it's kind of... But anyway, I'm not going to really open this up and, and show you fully. But it's, it's just a bunch of birds and foliage and a navy sort of color. Uh, peel and stick. This is a washi tape. See, I kind of, I kind of forgot how long it takes to open some of this stuff. 
Sorry, guys. I feel like I'm moving at a snail's pace. Okay, again, smaller than I thought, but cute. This is washi tape. Cute little colors, cute little box. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to break out one of my, I got into this before the birthday party, so I'm just going to use it as a trash can right now. Okay, I'm a little upset that this came this way, but it's a stained glass effect um, bluebird. And I can probably sort it out if I put it in between some books. Now, I heard this is funny. I heard about, I saw this on Shannon Shortcake. And I love Shannon Shortcake. She hauls, she does a lot of plus size hauls. She does a bunch of hauls and the plus, all kinds of hauls and plus size. And I love her sense of style and she just, she's just so nice and awesome. And like I said, she's a plus size like me. And I think she's even the same size as me. And I saw her haul this. And then like, I think the very next day I saw Dest haul it. And um, I, I had to get it. It's so cute. Um, it's, it feels, it feels, it's not, it's not the softest pajama I've ever felt, but it's fine. It's fine. But anyway, is look at how cute. Look at how cute. We've got all kinds of stuff on here. We got coffins. We got happy little ghosts. Um, look at these little cats. Look at cute little cauldron. We had to think of a name for this. Ka Kawaii goth core i don't know <laughs> but it's cute and it is it is shannon's shortcake style it's kind of like that it's it's a little bit girly um upbeat but also goth at the same time it's a mix of both again i don't like labels so that's just perfect for me because it's a little bit of everything happening here but i love these these are cute i'm really happy um i needed some more pajamas that for the for the cooler time and i am like adrian miller one comes in one goes out that's the best way to try to maintain control over it and i already threw away one because it had a hole in it so it's already gone out before it came in but i knew this was here i'm not gonna lie about that um but that's a good strategy if you're having trouble like um it's easier said than done sometimes, and stuff happens, and I'm not trying to lecture anybody, but it is a good strategy to, something comes in, something goes out, that is a good strategy for, especially if you're feeling a little overwhelmed. Um, looky there. I did, um, I did have, like, what I thought was like three or four bags worth of clothes that were too big for me kind of ready to go and I knew I had I know I have some more in my closet that can go but I went through thread up and I told somebody about it uh I think it was Gigi or Adrian or maybe even both that I suggested um because it's kind of like I mean I'm simplifying it I'm not sponsored I'm not affiliated or anything with that I'm just saying it's like it's a way to to give somebody else access to clothes that would fit them and that they would might want to use at a discounted price. And then you, if you're, if they sell, then you get money or credits or whatever back. And then you can get something new that fits you, that you like. It's like an upscale thrift store where you're kind of trading. That's really oversimplifying it. But um, 
if you're gonna try it, I just would suggest get as many bags as you can the first time because the first time the bags are free. And I got I got three for my first time thinking I only needed two. I mean, yeah, I did get, I did get, no, I got three thinking I only needed four because I didn't know about all that. And then when they came, they were so huge. Like, um, the stuff that I thought that I could get into four bags fit into two. So I have a whole bag now. Of, um, so I got everything out and then I have a whole bag now to put go through my closets again and put stuff in there. So I have that to do. I will do it. But anyway, I do love this. I do love it. So that's going in the wash and I'm going to feel like... I feel like I'm supposed to have more stuff than this, but maybe not. Um, I'll check it. I'll check it later. Um, I will have the link to this order in the description. And all my Timu stuff. All my affiliate codes and farmland codes and Cody Cody codes. Um, even though it doesn't really matter because I figured out like until it turns over again, I'm not, there's no point in really submitting any videos. Um, it's complicated, but if, if you're, especially if you're not, a uh, someone who's affiliated, just ignore me. Don't mind me. Um, so I got some, uh, little butterflies from... Tabby's hauls and everything when I won her giveaway and I was really I was looking for some more of those um because I usually have them come out this time of year and I used them to decorate something and I thought it was really cute and I wanted to get some more well I didn't find them well, this is the now we're going to the Dollar Tree but I found these and they're similar but you know instead of butterflies it's dragonflies which I love dragonflies Anyway, so, and then here's some just miscellaneous little bugs. We see my little, we see my little ladybug there. Um, I have a ladybug nickname, love bug for my husband. And then we got little bees. Anyway, that's cute. And then here's just some elephants. And my mom liked these. So I was like, let me get some for Anyway, I'm gonna use these on crafts and things. I'm gonna take this and throw it away into here. And then I'm gonna throw away all of this. I'm gonna move the trash around. Um. So has it been 15 to 20 minutes? I don't think so. My timer says 14 minutes, wow. Okay, so I guess I should, um, and I forgot to turn my light on and didn't have my light on this whole time. Um, I should share the Spirit Junkie card with you guys. Now I've already shuffled these and I'm just gonna take the one off the top Okay. I'm going to I'm going to read it. These are affirmation cards. When I lead from a place of love, people respect me. I love the artwork on this one. It's pretty, nice and springy. Look at all those pretty flowers. And I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it in with the other cards I've already done from Spirit Junkie in my little Mask Monday basket.
you know, you know, I got little this is this is and that's in there. I've got my lotions, my chapstick. I got my little stress ball that Wendy gave me. And I think what I'm gonna do is go ahead and take the mask off and sort of jot my face and then put on some of this lotion. Again, I wanna thank all the Mask Monday ladies and for Laura for introducing me, favors with Laura, Laura for introducing me to the concept of Mask Monday. I understand you're not the first one to do it, but you're the first one that I saw do it. And thank you for including me among the Mask Monday ladies. Um, I love you guys. All you guys are so awesome. Um, thank you for supporting me and hanging out with me as always. I really appreciate it. Um, Sawyer's migrated over here, closer to the window. It is, uh, it is nice today and the honeysuckles have bloomed and I can smell them out there, but it is like a swamp out there because of all the rain we've been having. So I can't really, I want to go out there and pick some honeysuckles and film it, but it's, it's like a lake. So I'm not doing that, I'm sorry. Uh, as soon as I can, as soon as I can, I will. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take this off. And I'm gonna kinda, the, I did dye my eyebrows too, and you gotta be careful with that if you do that, but it didn't really seem to take much. Maybe it did. It just doesn't seem to be as red. It seems to be more brown, but maybe that's just me. Um, so I'm just gonna kinda pat, pat, pat. This is a clean towel. And I'm gonna go with, and I've already removed the, I've already removed what needs to be removed. I'm gonna put my head thing back on. And I do encourage you guys um, to give yourself a little spa, I call it a spa day. Um, for me, I had a mask and manicure and me Monday. But it's a Sunday. Just don't want to be dishonest. But you know what I'm saying. It doesn't matter. It, a day of spa. A day of treating yourself and taking care of yourself and doing things for yourself. And I still have a lot of breakouts. And I can feel that. That hurts. I don't think you can see it very much. But that hurts. Here's one coming. All right. So now that I did that again, and that was a silly thing for me to do. Oh, uh, it feels nice and fresh though. Like I feel nice and fresh. And I did, in case I didn't say, I did go ahead and um, really wash my face before I did anything else. So my hands are clean. Though I do wish I had a spatula thing. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, so I have a smaller one, but I've used it for chapstick, so I'm just gonna use this bigger one. I do like this one, a little unicorn. It goes with my unicorn theme and my unicorn disco bathroom. Oh, what I'm using is from the Dollar Tree, and it's the Be Pure Hydrating Moisturizer. I also have the nighttime kind, but I'm using this. I, I know that, in my opinion, the, the daytime, what I'm putting on right now, has slight, slightly um, better ingredients, in my opinion, than the nighttime. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't usually do this. I usually just take my finger and stick it in there and wipe it all over my 
but this is the better way to do it because that way your stuff doesn't get contaminated. Make it sound like I have a hangout with that or something. It is more sanitary to go ahead and do this this way. Probably be most sanitary to just get one big giant glob and then spread it around. That's what I should have done, but oh well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, it's not important. So I think, I can't remember what all the ingredients um, that I like that are in here, but I know niacinamide is the one and I like that to try to help my unevenness. And especially under my eyes. So this is nice and smooth, it feels good. It has a smell. It's not a, it's not a bad smell but it does have a smell. I can't quite, I think maybe, I think maybe a little bit of a rose, a little rose. I think I'm getting a little rose of a smell there. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take my hand and And there it is. Oh. Ooh, it does. I can feel how soft. My, my skin feels clean and soft and refreshed. It's really nice. The whole combination is nice. So, um, Next time, maybe next time, I'll, maybe I'll try the niacinamide afterwards. The serum, we'll see how that goes. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed um, having a little bit of a relaxation time with me and me sharing my little uh, items, and that you enjoy your week, your upcoming week, and hang in there. Um, chin up. I'm saying it to myself too. And thank you so much for stopping by. Bye nutty buddies.